Hey, Howard, can you go to J.D. page one? In the upper left-hand corner, I guess this is from San Diego, a San Diego news station. Yeah. So it's from 5.15 their time. But they were promoting that um, Herman Cain's making a bold move by coming on the show. Oh, my God. <laughs> Excellent. Former presidential candidate Herman Cain is making a bold move. <laughs> he is now set to appear on the Howard Stern Show. You should have heard. Wait till they uh, run the clips of what he said to Robin. <laughs> Cain recently suspended his campaign following accusations of sexual harassment and a long-time affair. Wow. He's expected to sit down with Stern tonight for his satellite radio show. The big question is how Cain will handle the heat from Stern. Right. You don't even know when you're on. Nah, you got that wrong, too. Hey, you know what? You know what? Somebody said to me the other day, they go, I don't know if this shit's true with America's Got Talent. They go, but why Why are you wasting your talents? You should have a network interview show. Because you would become Edward R. Murrow. And then I went, that sounds like a lot of work being Edward R. Murrow. But it is true. I mean, people get excited when I... Like, Herman Cain's been interviewed by everyone, but... Yeah, it wouldn't be a big know. hoopla if he was sitting down with... Uh, Matt Lauer. Right. So, well, absolutely there would be, Robin. <laughs> no. <laughs> that would be considered yeah. something he would do. Out of the ordinary, right. Yeah. Well, uh, I think the last big get we got was when Arnold Schwar Schwarzenegger called in about blowing up the moon. <laughs> Remember that? And some people yes, reported people on that. Picked up on that. Uh, yeah, he was actually advocating blowing up the moon on our show. Funny, he didn't do it anywhere else. <laughs> <laughs> Herman Cain. Uh, yeah, well, Herman was here, and I'm sure he'll, he has created a lot of news today by what he said. Sure, he'll be getting a lot of calls right. later today. Yeah. So this is his wife's being very uh, annoying and demanding now that uh, <laughs> all this stuff happened.